So I'm just doing a short video to show you this test circuit I built for this uh, Xbox steering wheel. The finer product is going to use this Xbox steering wheel and the inputs such as the uh, angle of the steering wheel and the two pedals and maybe a few buttons on this to control a little robot like this. This is an old robot which has been hacked bits to get all the pieces I wanted for other projects so like the motors are missing and stuff like that but uh, I'm going to be rebuilding that a lot of sensors aren't going to be used like the rain sensor and the limit switch there and all that but uh, yeah we're going to be just building into a basic robot just drives and it's going to be controlled by a bluetooth module which one will be connected to this one will be connected to this so we can control it wirelessly so I'll just show you this right now so the steering wheel is being uh, controlled by an Arduino Uno and there's our little circuit and there's plenty of wires here but a lot of them aren't connected because we're not using all the inputs and the outputs from the steering wheel right now all we're using is the steering wheel, the two pedals uh, this Xbox button for it to turn it on and this player 2 LED and yeah I will show you the code now so that's the code which is going to be on the Instructables post, this is just for the test, like I said before. Uh, the full code will also be posted up. So I'm just going to run this, uh, clear that. Yeah. So now I'm just going to record the screen. And we've started. Two, one. So now when I press this button, our LED should turn on and we'll start reading in the inputs from the steering wheel and the pedals. Right now, because the steering wheel is at about halfway and I'm supplying it with 5 volts, it's giving out 2.42 volts. So it's nearly halfway. And if I turn it to the left, we go up to the full 5 volts. And if we turn to the right, we go down to 0 volts. So that's working there. And here's our reverse pedal, uh, called left pedal in the serial monitor. That's gone up to 4.21, which isn't a full 5 volts. There's probably a volt drop uh, along this long wire. But uh, in the final code, we could use, we could calibrate the code. So we'll say uh, this is the max we've recorded the pedal can go to. So we'll say that's what max speed is. And... Same with right pedal, it goes up to 4.5 volts. It, it is better, but it would still probably benefit setting like 4.5 volts as the max speed sent over to the little car. And then um, I'll just show you here. If we hold this for a second, it'll turn off. Uh, you have to hold it for a second because uh, to stop bouncing. So, like it isn't switching on and off real quick. And see on the uh, serial monitor, it says power off. And if I press it again, we're recording again. And yeah, so this is going to be on the uh, instructions post about this project, the code, the circuitry and how I built it and all, and how everything went. And the final project will be posted on that instructional post as well, which that will be in the description. So, thanks.